Namaskar. Welcome to this edition of the News Bulletin. In the headlines today, two executives of Raukela Steel Plant bag awards in sales story writing competition. And National Sports Day celebrated by sale Raukela Steel Plant. And now the news in detail. Mr. Devadatta Satpati, GM in charge CCW, and Ms. Munmun Mitra, DGM CSR of Raukela Steel Plant RSP have brought laurels for the Steel City by bagging awards in the All India Open Sale Story Writing Competition 2020, My Steel Story. In the English category of the competition, Mr. Satpati has bagged the first prize, while Ms. Mitra has got consolation prize. Notably, Mr. Anil Kumar Chaudhary, Chairman Steel Authority of India Limited Sale, announced the results of the competition on the company's social media handles of Facebook and YouTube on 28 August 2020. The story writing competition was an initiative by the company to create awareness amongst the people on steel uses. The competition's theme, Sale Creates a Meaningful Difference in People's Lives, both in Hindi and English languages, encouraged participants to share their experiences about sale and how the steel maker is changing or adding meaningful difference to the lives of people. The competition saw a huge participation and an overwhelming number of entries were received from across the country. Mr. Tarun Kumar Soni of Chhattisgarh won the first prize in the Hindi category. While announcing the results, Sri Anil Kumar Chaudhary congratulated the winners and said, We read a lot of stories, but the real story is one that gives a new shape to people's lives and makes their dreams come true. During its 60 years journey of steel production, SAIL has connected not only the country from one corner to another corner, but has also connected the hearts of the people of India with each other. He added, a huge number of entries were received from all over the country and this proves that SAIL has truly lived up to its tagline there is a little bit of sale in everybody's life. Sale Raukela Steel Plant RSP joined the rest of the country in celebrating National Sports Day on 29th August 2020. A function was organized at Biju Patnaik Hockey Stadium by the sports cell of RSP to mark the occasion, strictly adhering to the guidelines of COVID-19. Mr. Ajay Kumar Nayak, CGM, TA and CSR presided over the function that was attended by eminent sportspersons, employees of sports cell and the members of COVID control room. The dignitaries paid tributes to the legendary Indian hockey player Major Dhyan Chand, whose birthday is celebrated as the National Sports Day. Speaking on the occasion, Mr. Nayak highlighted the contributions of RSP in promoting sports in the region and shaping the future of numerous successful sporting icons of the region. At the outset, Mr. B.K. Rauth, GM, P, H, L and SW welcomed the gathering. Mr. Raghu Padi, Assistant Manager Sports, proposed a formal vote of thanks. It is said that the playgrounds of Raukela steel plant are as old as its blast furnaces. The steel plant since its inception is promoting sports and sportspersons apart from grooming budding talents. The magnificent Ispat Stadium with a capacity of 10,000 audience where many a player of international and national repute has displayed his or her skills. The impressive Biju Patnaik Hockey Stadium with 30,000 strength and adorned with a synthetic turf. The indoor stadium, Kabaddi complex, basketball complex, volleyball complex, chess hall, boxing ring and several other fields and courts all offer an eloquent testimony to RSP's efforts at providing the ideal sporting environment to its stakeholders. The glorious sporting history of RSP 
boasts of his association with four Arjuna Award winners, namely Michael Kindo, hockey, Sunil Patra, bodybuilding, Mr. Ramen Ghosh, badminton, and Minati Mahapatra, cycling. Besides, many eminent sportspersons like P. N. Gantayat, athletics, P. M. Mahanti, chess, Sanjay Pradhan, Hemant Patel, Rabi Narayan Panda have been part of the sports portal of the steel plant. Raukila Steel Plant has orchestrated and implemented a proactive strategy to provide an opportunity to the young talents to hone their sporting skills and shine in the national and international firmament. As Sundargar region is considered as the cradle of hockey, Raukila Steel Plant has always been in the forefront in the promotion of hockey. The setting up of the prestigious Sale Hockey Academy and the Biju Patnaik Hockey Stadium vouch for this fact. The academy that was set up in 1992 on 15 acres of land at Raukela is dedicated to the promotion of the game. Every year cadets for this academy is chosen through a tough screening process and thereafter all care is taken to ensure that all the cadets are completely focused on the game itself impervious to peripheral constraints. Free boarding and medical facilities, a balanced diet, furnished accommodation, education and a state-of-the-art gymnasium are some of the examples of the facilities provided by the SHA to the cadets. In addition to these, a cadet is provided with a stipend. The academy has so far produced 10 players who have represented India in various international matches including Birendra Lakra, the star player who has so far played more than 100 international matches. Some other celebrated prodigies are Jeram Lakra, Sushil Khalko, Anand Lakra, Subodh Tirki, Pankaj Kumar Rajak and Shilanand Lakra. In recent times, Rima Lakshmi Ekka has brought laurels to the steel city representing the Indian women's team and the Odisha state in different national and international tournaments. Swasti Singh, the golden girl of the steel city with handful of international medals has been a true revelation in cycling. Similarly, the talented footballer brothers duo Arpan Lakra and Arbin Lakra of the Steel City have the pride of representing the Odisha state football team in different national championships, including Santosh Trophy for the last two seasons. All the budding star sporting stars have honed their skills at the facilities of RSP under the tutelage of coaches of the sports department of the steel plant. And that's all for now. Namaskar.